Vilnius is the capital of Lithuania. Yuzupis, the most mysterious district of Vilnius. A bohemian and artistic part of the city. It's a place of extraordinary things, where tourists, merchants and dreamers swarm. One day people couldn't believe their eyes when they saw the mysterious druid procession marching down to the river Vilnel. Ritual drums were beating and strange sounds were heard. It's a shamanic wedding, said art critic Jane Bloom, who lives nearby. Where is the mysterious procession going? wondered more than one curious tourist and local drunk. And so the procession turned into the gateway of the third house on Yuzupas Street. And after passing through the courtyard, they waded into a stream. There was thunder in the sky. We want to make an offering to the gods. We want to pay our respects to all those who are gathered here. Because here we are creating things that never were. They were making an offering to the gods. And during this beautiful and meaningful ceremony, colorful canoes floated down the creek. After that, many things became clear. It was the opening of Black Spikes, the most original barbershop in the capital. You will find the barbershop in the courtyard of the third house on Ajupi Street. Ladies and gentlemen, thank you. Thank you for attending the opening of my friend Simona's hair salon. And we want to introduce a wonderful painter, Lina Sassinas. He has created a wonderful painting called Genghis Khan's Dream. He will tell you the story of the creation of the masterpiece. Creation is a mysterious thing. It sometimes repeats itself, and sometimes it does not. Genghis Khan's dream was created a long time ago. The interior of the barbershop is decorated with paintings by the most extravagant artist in Vilnius, Lina Sassinas. These are warm and playful works. People enjoyed the harmony emanating from the paintings. And the artist was changing the music records. The Black Spikes Barbershop is really fun. Be sure to visit, enjoy the art, get your beard, hair, soul and everything else sorted.